What is going on guys? Check out madmobilecoins.com for some of the fastest and cheapest coins out there and use my code ELITE for 10% off. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing the very first 99 overall player in Madden Mobile 17, Marcus Allen, the Super Bowl legend. Can I get an amen? Everybody, I just totally wrecked my microphone, but this is so incredible. This is historic. First 99 overall in Mad Mobile. This Super Bowl promo that just dropped yesterday is insane. Well, actually, you guys are seeing this like a day after it drops, but I'm recording this the day that these, this promo dropped, and it's insane. And currently, Marcus Allen, the 99 overall beast, is pullable. We also have a ton of like 97 overalls, 96 overalls. I already pulled an offensive tackle 96 that sold for 2 million coins. It's been a good day. Um, so what I'm doing for you guys now is I'm just shredding through 100 of the big game packs. This is hype. This promo is so hype. There's so much good stuff we can pull. We start off with an elite already. Uh, that's pretty hype. And I know I'm going to be completing that awesome MVP set. I do it every year. Uh, you turn in a ton of elite and gold players and you get yourself a guaranteed... Oh, nice elite. Uh, you get yourself a guaranteed 99 overall player of whoever the MVP is in the Super Bowl. Uh, I love how they do that, because then, like, when you're watching the Super Bowl, it gives you a reason to, like, want a certain person to be the MVP, and, ooh, nice, Akib Tlaib. Uh, so, like, for example, if Tom Brady wins the MVP, I won't be very happy. That would kind of be disappointing, because I don't want to see Tom Brady in another MVP award. Whoa! Whoa! No freaking way! We got the 94 Alex Mack! Oh, my God! A little bit ago, he was going for, like, 400k. That's so crazy! We're already pulling 94s. Oh, that's crazy. I have him on my team. He's my center right now. That's why I wasn't an update team. But that's insane. Wow, we're already pulling some heat in this opening. There's a Bud Dupree. Oh, and let me let me know. Do you guys have any reason why you think the team of the the team of the week promo just kind of stopped? Because normally, like last year and the year before that, uh, whoa, another hype pack. Uh, but like the team of the week promo, like they did it for the AFC championship, NFC championship round, and then also for the Super Bowl. But they just didn't do it this time. They just kind of ignored it, I guess, and just let it go. I don't know, probably because they were kind of, you know, dealing with a ton of new promo stuff like the Super Bowl. Oh, shoot, I just skipped something. I think it was a basic, a base elite, though. Um, yeah, EA is probably dealing with, you know, they got this, uh, this promo out. They got, um, they had team of the year to deal with. They had Pro Bowl to deal with. So many, so much good content coming out recently. Aside from team of the year, did I accidentally almost just say team of the year is a good promo? It's not, by the way. EA, if any of, if anyone watching this video represents EA in any way, please know that for next year, whatever you did for team of the year, completely get rid of it. Go back to the way it was, please. We just want 94 to 97 overall players that were beast during the NFL season. That's all we want. But instead, we got we got team of the year golds. And whoa, Tyreek Hill, how you doing, my boy? Oh, I like it. We're already cruising through these packs. We got about 20 of them knocked out. Um, we're doing decent. Already pulled a 94 overall center. Um, haven't pulled that Marcus Allen yet, though. Oh, can you imagine? Like, that's li literally probably like golden ticket status. Like, if I could pull the 99 Marcus Allen, the first 99 in the game, oh, I would freak out. More than I've ever freaked out before, like, it would be good. That He probably is around the rareness of, like, golden tickets and ultimate legends, because, I mean, I don't know. He goes for, like, he's going for, like, 10 mil last time I checked, and that's just such a high number, especially for, uh, for the current Madden Mobile status of uh, Auction House and everything. Um, all right, so these packs have been dry. I won't sugarcoat it. I'll tell you, I'll tell it straight what it is. These packs have been a little dry recently, but uh, I want to talk about these packs in general, though. In general, they're pretty juiced. Like, they're good. I'd recommend opening them. Like, bam, there we go. We get a quick Andrew Whitworth. Um, like, I pu I've been pulling so many playoff players out of these packs. Uh, it's kind of insane. Like, but like the good ones, like 92 to 90 overall. So many of the good playoff players. I've completed a couple sets even with the playoff sets. Made some coins. It was pretty awesome, honestly. Uh, I made a ton of coins for my recent Pro Bowl Hero opening. You should check that out. That was a crazy opening. I made so many coins from a couple of hype pulls. If you haven't seen that, you might want to go check her out if you haven't seen it yet. 
Um, come on, big game packs. Where are you at? Where's the heat at? I'm looking for some more of that uh, luck we had early on with that 94 overall Alex Mack. I still can't believe that. Uh, there's a Dion Jones, first elite in a little while. And we're already getting close to the halfway point of the opening. How sad would it be if we don't pull, like, I don't know, at least I want to pull a Super Bowl player in this. Like, that would be the goal. If we could get, like, a nice Super Bowl elite, that would be nice. Um, but, yeah, while I was in school, actually, like, early in the morning, I did the first Super Bowl elite upgrade set. And I figured, uh, ooh, nice Jonathan Sleepin'. Uh, but I did it, and I was like, I was thinking, like, oh, great, what's this going to be? Probably more 90 overalls. Um, just like Team of the Year and all that, a bunch of 90, 91 overalls. Then I opened it, and it was that 96 overall offensive tackle. I was freaking out. He literally goes for, like, 2.2 million coins. At least that's how much he went for when I sold him. It was a rush, let me tell you. Um, but, no. oh, shoot. There we are. There we are. Nice, we got a nice, uh, you know, Super Bowl pull, the first one. It's only a 91, but it's definitely a good thing because we can throw him in the MVP set. Um, nice. Or we could throw him in the 98 overall, um, what's it called? That Like that some Super Bowl hero set or something. I forget his name, but I don't know. He's some good guy who did something good in the Super Bowl, so he got a card. Um, but nice, we got a Super Bowl elite. That was one of our goals. Um, now let's see if we can, oh. I thought that Greg Olson was going to be a Super Bowl player, but nah, just one of those crappy team of the year players, tricking me, tricking me like they do, but it's cool. I have a feeling these packs have a couple more surprises they're going to throw my way. One of them, one of those surprises I have a feeling is going to be named Marcus Allen, but uh, that's that's just uh, you know up to how generous EA wants to be. If they want to be super generous and just dish me a quick uh, Marcus Allen. Um, you know, I'd be pretty happy about it. But I'll, like, literally, I don't know if I want to pull Marcus Allen, though, because if I did, I'd probably, like, throw my microphone. It would probably slam into my monitor. My laptop would probably go flying. I would be in such, like, a such a rage of happiness that I would destroy my whole setup here. Um, so, it's, I don't know. What's better, 10 million coins or, like, a functioning YouTube setup? Oh, my goodness. Did we just get... Uh, a lot of Pro Bowl or a lot of Super Bowl items in that pack. Nice. Definitely the more Super Bowl items the better. Um Hmm. Oh, let me know what you guys think. I I've meaning to ask you guys about this. I haven't really talked about this too much, but the fact that EA's been letting us buy as many packs as that we want. Do you guys like that idea? I know my answer is instantly yes. I love the idea so much. I love just ripping as many packs. Ooh, nice. Golden Tate. I like it. Um, but yeah, what I was gonna say, like, I love the idea of just ripping just like a hundred packs like this. I just love it so much. It's so fun to just go through and try to get that good pull that you've been trying to get. And I don't know, I find it really enjoyable. So, um, the longer EA lets us buy whatever we want, I think it's, uh, you know, it's a good day as long as EA is letting us buy whatever the heck we want. Cause like, imagine if there was like a five pack item limit on the big game packs. How fun would that be? It wouldn't be very fun at all. We'd all be sitting here just like... Showing like, hey, five big game packs. This is so fun. When in reality, here I am cracking open a hundred of them for you guys. What do you guys like more? Five packs or a hundred packs? I think I have my answer. Obviously, five packs is better. Let's be real here. Real talk with Elite. Late hours. Honestly, it is pretty it's getting pretty late here. It's 10, 11 p.m. I gotta get to bed pretty soon. Gotta wake up at the good old crack of dawn. I'm not even looking at the packs anymore. I'm just talking about random stuff. Who know, I probably could have pulled Marcus Allen for all I know. He's probably waiting on my bench right now. Um, man, only one Super Bowl play. That's a little, it's a little disappointing, honestly. That these are big game Super Bowl packs, and we've only pulled one Super Bowl player. Oh shoot! There's a nice team of the week pack. Two team of the week elites. Definitely not a bad thing with that pack. Um, dang, I was actually kind of hoping we would pull Marcus Allen, but I do not think it's going to happen. Um, believe it or not, we're actually not going to pull the rarest player in the game. Who would have thought that? Oh, well. I don't think anyone's pulled it yet. Has any, like, uh, YouTuber or anything pulled it? 
I don't know how many, I'm not sure how many videos are out on this already, but if you've seen someone pull a Marcus Allen, let me know because I want to go watch that video. Um, oh, Harrison Smith. For some reason, I thought he was Marcus. I don't know why, but as soon as I see red, I'm just going to assume Marcus Allen from now on. Man, we're, we're uh, closing in on the final 10 packs pretty soon. It's uh, definitely a, a sad thing because I spent, what, 5 million coins? Yeah. Oh, no. No. I saw an update team, and then I looked up, and it was a playoff player. Man, that could have been really good. But now, just a playoffs player, no big deal. I'll definitely take it. 92 playoff players go for a decent amount of coins. Um, yeah, what was I saying? I spent 5 million coins on this pack opening. And I do not think I've made that back yet. Uh, oh, Harrison Smith again. Um, but yeah, until I pull off, I don't know, Marcus Allen or, uh, you know, I don't know. Some really good Super Bowl player. I'm not making any coins back. I don't know. Unless I do really good in the Super Bowl Elite upgrades, but... Something tells me that's not happening either. I think I just got lucky once and it's not going to happen again. Um, oh, man. I thought that Sean Lee was a Super Bowl player too. Man. They got me. They got me all over the place. Thinking I get good stuff, then I don't. Oh, come on, big game pack. Hook me up with some love. No. Oh, I don't want any of them golds. I want some Super Bowl players. Oh, okay. Don't say Hightower. Technically a Super Bowl player, I guess. But uh, not the kind I'm looking for. I'm looking for the legit Super Bowl players. The program Super Bowl players. All right. Four packs left. Pretty disappointing uh, opening. I mean, it's been okay. I mean, we got that 94 overall pull in the beginning. Uh, that definitely wasn't too bad. But it kind of died off since then. We only got one Super Bowl pull. That's kind of lame. Oh, another update team. It's a Dan Williams 90 overall defensive tackle. Man, that tells me my, my defensive tackles are pretty weak if a 90 overall is an update team. I got to do some shopping sprees or something here to fix that up real quick. Um, and look at that. What better way to finish the pack opening but with a bonus pro pack? What if we pull Marcus Allen in this pack? I would die. Oh my god, here we go. Yeah. We didn't pull them. What What are those odds? Alright, so let's go to the sell item section. Check out what we got. We actually got some decent stuff. There's, um, nice. Look at all that. Uh, here's the best pull of the opening, Alex Mack. I kind of want to see how much he goes for before I let you guys go. Uh, just because I know he went for like 400k at one point. That probably has gone down. Oh, it's gone very, very down. Yeah, he goes for like 100k. Dang it, I overhyped that pretty much. So apparently he's not the best pull. Probably some of these playoff players uh, are some of the best pulls, but I don't care. It was a good opening. I still like opening packs with you guys. It's one of my one of my favorite things to do. So yeah, thanks for watching, guys. See you all in the next video. See you guys later.